Okay, so here we have a Xerox Altalink C8055. It's uh, Xerox's newest technology. If you want to get a closer look, as you can tell, it's a very clean machine. It has port four paper trays, well, five. Uh, the top two, one and two, hold up to 11 by 17. Three and four hold up to letter size paper. And then through the bypass tray five, you can run that heavier stock up to 12 by 18. Uh, let's get a closer look in here. Um, copy, print, scan, fax, print from USB, you have that option. Um, and this specific device, let's see. Supplies are gonna all be at 100%, so toners were put in brand new. Other supplies, drums were put in brand new, except the one is at 94%, but the other ones are at 100%. Uh, second bias transfer roller also replaced, 99%. Uh, transfer belt cleaner, 99%. So the machine's not going to need anything for quite a while. I'm just going to go ahead and print out the uh, supply report so you can kind of take a look at that on the page itself. This machine comes with an office finisher. It staples, and uh, we're just going to go ahead and wait here. This is just the supply page. As you can tell, everything's new, very nice, sharp, bright colors. C8055. Everything is pretty much at 100% except one drum. That's going to be at 94%. Uh, this specific machine has a total meter count of 146,846. A serial number is ATB559690. The machine has less than a month of use. It's fully refurbished and gone through, so it's in excellent working condition. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and just print out so you get a feel for the quality. Let's see, information pages. Just a graphics demo page. And then I'll go ahead and put in a USB just to print some other images as well. Nice thing about this machine, that gives you low cost per copy, great quality and reliability. Nice. So you can actually purchase these consumables directly through us as well. They're very inexpensive. This is just a demos page. Very nice, clean image. And uh, your configuration report here. The machine is ready to plug and play. I'm going to go ahead and just print a couple more images through the USB. Uh, as you can tell, I inserted my USB right here. Click the home button, print from, and then it pulls them all up. And I don't have a by 17 paper in there currently. A very nice touch screen. Easy to access. 8.5 by 11. Let's go ahead and do some uh, something bright. Like flowers. So I'm just going to go ahead and click print. As you can tell, you, right when you, uh, before you hit print, you can kind of uh, play around, see if you want it sharper, darker, lighter. You can do all of that on there. So this is printing directly from a USB, just so you get a feel for it. This is the flowers. This is just regular 8.5 by 11 paper. I'm going to go ahead and make a few copies. Regular copies. Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and take my USB out, go home, copy. Once again, when you make a copy, you need you can play around with it. If you want to pick from a certain paper supply, reduce, enlarge, uh, sharpen, darken. Um, you can do quite a bit there. I'm just gonna do one copy for all. Just want to see the ADF system picking up very smoothly. Recognizing it in the machine. Fairly quick machine, 55 pages per minute. Nice color. This is copy. Looks pretty, pretty good for a copy. Still sharp, clean, well printed. And uh, right in here, just gonna go ahead and show you the consumables. It's gonna be your black toner, 26,000 yield, 
Each one is going to give you, I believe, 14 to 15,000 yield at 5% coverage. Your drums are right in here. You just go ahead and push that over. And then you have your four colored drums, which are all interchangeable. So that's the nice thing about this. Close it up. Your waste container. Your cleaning blade. It's all very simple. And yep, that is it.